Welcome back to the channel. I've got the Toro Recycler 21 here and it seems to be a trend that Toro is kind of moving away from including a side discharge on the mower. So you can see no side discharge, no side discharge. And what they're doing instead is they're offering this rear side discharge unit and you have to actually send away for it. So in order to get this, if you've picked up a Toro Recycler that doesn't have the side discharge on it, what you're gonna wanna do is go to toro.com slash register. You're gonna put in the model number and the serial number, which is on this little white sticker on the deck of the mower. And at the bottom of that register page, there's a little checkbox that you check that says you want them to mail you the rear side discharge chute. So I wanted to just show you what this looks like. I'm gonna come up close here. Black flies are pretty bad, but this goes where the bagger is on your mower. So you take the bagger off, these rods stick into the holes that hold the bagger, and then it's a huge discharge chute. I don't really, I don't know. It seems like kind of a odd solution, but what you do is you just take the bagger off and then we just take the side discharge. It's more like a rear side discharge. It goes into those same grooves on the mower that the bag sits into. This just comes down onto it, folds it down, and then side discharges right out here. So I'm gonna start this up, show you what it looks like running. And there's not much more to it than that. It sprays the grass out the side. It's actually more robust than the side discharge chute that came with my Recycler 22. That one had a couple of little pins on it. Just kind of felt kind of like crappy side discharge chute. This is definitely a beefy rear side discharge chute. But again, to go get this, because it's not gonna come included with the mower, you're gonna go to toro.com slash register, put your name, address, the model and serial number of your mower. Check the box that says you want to receive the rear side discharge. They'll send it to you free of charge. Uh, it came actually, they say it takes a few weeks. It only took about a week for me to get mine. And honestly, it kind of works well. It feels a lot bigger. We'll see if there's a lot of grass coming out here. I feel like it's going to catch on here. But for me in this mower, I'm not doing a lot of like heavy mowing. But if I was, that's a nice, hefty rear discharge. So, I don't know, I'll be interested to see how it works as we get through the summer. But that is the rear side discharge. Again, this is what it looks like. Giant output here, and it really, I mean, comes out of what would normally go to the bagger, comes shooting out this side. So there you go, just a piece of plastic with a rod in it. For free, they'll send it to you. I wish they'd just include it with the mower so you don't have to send away for it because mulching and bagging is great, but a lot of times I'm on a side discharge. So anyway, I hope this video was helpful for you if you're curious where your side discharge is on your new mower. Hopefully this helps you out. If you have any questions, throw them down in the comments below. I'll do my best to answer them. I'll talk to you guys later.